Hello, boys and girls. Mr. Paust here. So, so glad to hear from you. Um, you were looking at a picture of the Mall of America, and it's located in Minnesota. So, um, that's considered the Midwest, and it's an amazing mall if you get a chance to go there. I went there a couple of years ago, and uh, they have almost any store you can think of. They even have roller coasters in the mall. They have, like, Nickelodeon Studios. Lots of great stuff. So, let's get into learning today. All right, what do we have here? Mall of America. More than 270 million people from all over the world have visited the Mall of America since it opened in 1992. Located in Bloomington, Minnesota, it is the nation's largest mall. It has more than 500 stores, employs about 11,000 people, and makes more than $1.5 billion a year. Located in Minnesota. Here's the Mississippi River and the Mall of America. I love a good mall. People work to earn money that they can use to buy goods and services. The money they are paid is their income. People earn their income in many ways. The clerk at a mall's clothing store earns an income by selling shirts and jeans. Some people in the same community work in factories that make the products sold at the mall. Others earn an income by delivering the products from the factories to the stores. What is an income? Now remember, we gotta go back into the text. And there it is, bright yellow. The money people are paid is their income. How does the clerk at the mall earn income? How does the clerk at the mall earn income? Okay, let's look into the text. The clerk at a mall's clothing store earns an income by selling shirts and jeans. What is another way to earn an income? Others earn an income by delivering the products from the factory to the stores. So there's multiple ways you can earn an income, boys and girls. Bianca Schott works as a, I'm sorry, Bianca Schott works on a car engine. Earning money, Bianca Schutt is an automobile mechanic in San Diego, California. A mechanic repairs cars. Schott earns her income by providing this service to car owners. Today, one of every three workers in the United States earns an income by providing services to customers. I like my work, Schott says. She enjoys being useful in her community. This gives her a good feeling in addition to the money she earns. When Bianca Schutt is working at the garage, she is a producer. She is paid for providing her service, just as a factory worker is paid for making a product. What does an automobile mechanic do? All right, so looking back in the text, it says Bianca Schott is an automobile mechanic. And it says a mechanic repairs cars. Very important job. How does Bianca feel about her job? Look at her feelings now. See the quotation marks? I like my work, Schott says. What is Bianca called when she is working at her garage? When Bianca Schott is working at the garage, she is a producer. All right, doing good, boys and girls. Schott looks for products that are on sale so she can get more for her money. See the sales price is $29.99, now it's $19.99. Shot looks for products that are on sale so she can get more for her money. Spending money. Bianca Shot spends much of her income on her basic needs. She needs to eat, so she buys food. For clothing, she buys dark colored pants and shirts for work and other clothes for home. She uses a big part of her income to pay the monthly rent for her apartment. Once Schott's basic needs are met, she can buy other items. She sometimes buys new furniture for her apartment. She also likes to see movies. When she spends money, she's a consumer. She's buying a product or service instead of making or providing one. Why would Bianca buy items that are on sale? What did it say about that? Schott looks for products that are on sale so she can get more for her money. So she's getting more for her money. Number two, 
What does Bianca buy once her basic needs are met? It says once Charlotte's basic needs are met, she can buy other items. She sometimes buys new furniture for her apartment. So she can buy new furniture for her apartment. And number three, what is Bianca called when she's spending money? Okay, when she spends money, she's a consumer. Say a consumer, boys and girls? Consumer. Awesome. Shot uses an automatic teller machine, ATM, to put her savings into the bank. Savings and sharing. Bianca Schott saved the money she has not spent. The money people do not spend is their savings. People save money so they will have they will have to spend it in the future. They'll have it to spend in the future. They may need it in an emergency. Some people use their savings to take a vacation or buy a home. Many young people save for a college education. Many older people save for retirement. When they no longer work, they will earn no income. Bianca Schutt shares with others some of the money she earns. She gives money to groups that help people in her community and around the world. Why would someone choose to save money? What do they say about that? People save money so they will have to have it to spend in the future. So she's saving money so she can spend it in the future. What would young people use their savings for? Some people use their savings to take a vacation or buy a home. All right, number three. What would older people use their savings for? Uh, many older people save for retirement. There we go. All right. I hope you really enjoyed this and learned a lot about saving money and being responsible citizens, boys and girls. And I will see you soon.